then move through to face the Korean. So on stage now, Kim Kyujo from Korea. Match win record 100%. It's nice to have in World Archery. And Ku Tingan from Taipei. Taipei who dominated the cadet category this morning. Both now here to fight out the world title. Matt, you've exactly. seen some of these girls shoot this week. So what have you seen? Oh, well, um, again, we've got the number one ranked in uh, Kim shooting against the third ranked Ku. But uh, one of our girls, Sarah Haywood, in the round of 16 shot against Kim. And it was, you know, gusty, blusty uh, wind conditions. And um, yeah, she, she lacked confidence, uh, Kim. She really was hesitant with her shots and uh, was lucky to get through. Sarah Haywood um, was five, one up. Wow. And uh, then Kim came back to take it to a tiebreaker and then win in a one-hour shoot-off. So, um, again, I, I was surprised given the her hesitation that she made it through to this gold medal match. But again, see how she goes. She's the number one ranked. Low eight there. So I've, I've noticed people starting to go low, as we've both said it looks. The screens look really bright now, don't they? Yeah, it is getting really dark. So eight for both athletes. You shoot, you've got the scoreboards, 10 metres in front of the targets, and they're very bright. That's going to draw your eye. Yeah, exactly. That is good. Fast attacking archery like the Korean women always do. Good group from the Taipei shooter, Ku. Nice quick match. Oh, yeah, they're not hanging around, yeah. are they? So, he looks to a coach. Yeah. What is that there? They're, um, again. There we go. So, all no. Who nicks that, yeah, yep. with a 26. Ku doesn't look very... Uh, uh, form doesn't look what I expect from a tight page. No, no. Really very yeah. strange. Um, quite European. Yeah, Exactly, but um, you know, the Korean archer Kim, she uh, is relying heavily on her coach. Yeah, and that was evident during the elimination round. She really struggled with her confidence. Yes, because of the wind, and um, you know, she really had to dig deep and uh, get the support from her coaching staff and her, her peers to get her through the matches. So yeah. it'll be interesting to see how she goes in this next set. She's down right now. Ku looks like, yep, yeah, this is fun. Yep. Kim looks like she's got the way of the world on her shoulders. Yeah. Well, uh, as we saw in the cadet matches, the uh, the Taiwanese archers uh, defeated the Koreans. Yeah. And you know, took away the majority of the the gold medals. So set number two. Miss Kim from Korea will be shooting first. Big expectations on her. Yes. Very normal looking shot, but quite a long hold here. Oh, Left eight again. So, look straight back at a coach. Yep. Wanting some instruction and guidance. Yeah. Ten. So, Ku is here to fight. So you to so find the 10 ring, Kim. No, I know. She's not even close, really. Really laid back style. Really flat. Long hold, though. Very. Over 10 seconds. Oh, wow. I actually nearly thought the screen had frozen then. Yeah. <laughs> was that she was one? so still, but yeah. lost her momentum. But good on her. Fought it through. That was fast. 10, finally. Much Quick better. shot. Oh, 29. He's doing this quite easy, Ku. 4 nil up. Yeah, well, Ku is the number three seed this week. And the Korean there, you can see him, the fingers out, and he's giving us some big instructions. I want to inspect them before you shoot them. Yeah. He's going through the motion. Just to me, the Kim is just relying too much 
on her coach. Yeah. She's got to stand up there and take ownership. Yeah, like Makes who it. is there. She's exactly. just not saying anything. She's looked down. She's had a nod. Yep. And her game's taking over now. And now Kim, she's 4-0 down. Yeah. She, she needs to win this set to stay in the match. I think in boxing they say you've got to come out swinging. Yep. Yeah. Uh, needs her coach screaming 10 to make yeah, Koo know she's, exactly. she's working. Yep, she's really heavily relying on, on the coach. Okay, so Kim to lead off set three. Good shot. But no. Yeah, frustration. Yeah, she didn't like that. Oh, just looked across. Yeah. We both looked straight exactly. at the wind socks. I but think a bit uh, of tension in the in her uh, drawing hand. Yeah, but uh, sort of giving an opening for Kim. Kim was just uh, rolling along so yeah, ever confidently. Actually, these are a bit straighter, yeah. but they're not. They are, yeah. But not a massive amount. Not enough to put you in the six. Nine, that's that's enough for Kim to steal this very scrappy third set, actually. Well, 25 for Kim, yep. 23 for Ku. So Ku will still lead 4-2. Yeah. A little more. Kim looks a little more relaxed. Yeah. Q's now chatting to her coach, but but, uh, but she's very fidgety. She's uh, yeah <laughs> going through her release um, sequence still. Yeah. A little laugh there. Yeah. A little bit more confident from Kim. But it is getting very dark. The um, the LCD screens are really, really bright now. Yes. Yeah. Just a lot going on. That's yep. going to look like a bit of a tunnel because that wall was set for the 60 meter yep. targets earlier. They've moved the main yeah. targets back. That's going to really funnel down the shot. Yep. Left nine, a lot of arrows gone left yeah. in this match. So Ku needs to keep strong. Great shot, ten. So making it difficult for Kim. Again, she needs to win this set. Getting close to the ten again, but still only the one arrow in the ten for Kim. Who seems to have quite a powerful bow. Yeah, she's, um, apart from that six she had in the previous set, she's got a very clean, tidy release. Long nice. hold. Yeah, that's ten. Great ten. So, ten to be world champion for Ku. Oh, <laughs> so, 28 apiece. There's nothing wrong with that. Good yeah, group that way. Yeah, really good performance from both arches, 28 yeah. apiece. Yeah, good high standard. But we got a 5 3 lead to uh, Ku. Yeah. So Kim will need to take this set for it to go to a tiebreaker. So still the advantage for Ku. It's. I find 5 3 is a, it's a hard number because if you've got the 5. You do not want to have shoot off now. Yeah. If you've got the three, you know you, you know, yes, you've got to win the set. You, you throw everything at yeah. it because it, it's bust or nothing, isn't it? And, you know, at the archers, they need to continually you know, do scenarios, train for these moments, you know, train for a 5 3, train for a 4 all situation because um, the rally is. You know, it's going to happen in a final. Yes. And uh, you need to have your focus. 
So Ku needs to, just to continue to be confident. You see Kim there still going through a sequence. Yeah. I think that's a nervous, they nervous do it a habit, lot, don't they, the Korean women? Yep. yep. See Kibo Bay do that so yeah. much. Yeah. And I think um, you know, just part of their routine. Yeah. Both coaches giving a lot of instruction yeah. there. Yep. I think the coaches are very nervous themselves. <laughs> <laughs> so. Yeah, Taipei are going to want this to yep. really yes. rattle Korea. Exactly. You know, it's Korean boys are both in the yeah the, the uh, final next, so it's a guaranteed Korean gold medal. But Kim has an opportunity now to come back. There's the ten. Yep. That's the start she really wanted. Long hold. Long hold. Yes. Oh, eight this time. Didn't get away with it. Really unusual uh, hold there. She's just aiming far, far too tight. Yep. Oh, Kim's finding a stride. Yep. And again, we spoke about the momentum shifting. If this is to go to a tiebreaker, oh, then Kim go. is in the box seat. You know, she's a shoot off. Starting to find the tens. Goes to a one arrow shoot off. Oh. oh. Okay. Finally a smile. That's the that's the five three end, isn't it? Yep. And as I said, it, 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 it's exactly what we were talking about. Yep. Kim came out, threw yep. everything at it. Yep. Ku tried to not make it. Yes, work. exactly. Long hold. Playing, playing defensively, and um, now she finds herself in a one-hour shoot-off. Yeah, closest to the middle, and she's going to hold. Yeah. <laughs> you know. So yeah. Kim in the box seat. Staring that ten down already, and it's it's hard for the archers. You know, they've had all week of shooting. Going through yep. the ranking round, the elimination rounds, and then for a world championship to be decided on one single arrow, oh. it's you know it's gut wrenching for the you know the unfortunate arrow, archer that finishes second. Yeah, but it's the nature of this match play format, you know. I think the hardest thing I've seen was um, the recent Berlin World Cup. The two Dutch compound men, Mike Sars and Peter Alsen, yeah, both shot perfect 150s. Yes. And even worse, in the one-hour shoot-off, both yep. athletes hit the spider. And so, unfortunately, it was Peter, I think. Peter by yep. a millimetre. Yep. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah, yeah, yeah. And, I mean, the archers got to walk away and say, well, like, I didn't they, lose. They I didn't lose. Uh, Slosher won. You know. Shot perfect. And, yep. uh, so, yeah. yeah. So, it will be Kim to shoot first. Yes. In this single-arrow shoot-off. To decide the world champion. It's big shot this both of them. Nervous body movements there from Kim. Yep. Hours and hours of training down One to this hour. moment. Just that. It's a good nine. So. Very Ku has an opportunity. Will she go for it? Another long hold? No. Oh, <laughs> left eight. So, I'm calling that to Kim. Yeah, <laughs> easy. She's got it. She's happy. Yep. Sigh of relief. I think she got off there. Yep. No, she, uh, Ku, you know, yeah. she came out very, very consistent. Yeah. Apart from that third end with where both archers really lost their way for a while. Yes. But Kim to come back on that final set. 10-10-10. Yeah. That was the big swing. 